Can we do something? Uh, it's just in the monitors, just soften them a little bit. The brightness. And also uh, a repeat or a play, something that's just going to soften it. It's just hitting me really hard up here. One of the, the main attractions of a song written by someone else is that there is nothing personal about it. And call. It's not long enough to play. It's not carrying it. You know your last phrase, the two, the four-bar phrase, and I'll just sing. A desert road from Vegas to nowhere. Let's see what it sounds like. Vegas to nowhere. Yeah, just like that. So what I'll, I'll do, I'll sing the the whole two-verse section where I sing the hot, dry wind bit and the, the, those two verses, and then I'll do one. I'm calling you, I'm calling you. And then, then you come in again with uh, the solo, and then finish it with those two lines. And just saying, right, this is an instrument, and this is me using it to the best of my ability. Let me warm up, man. Is that the key? is something that, again, is a very important consideration. Okay. So do we work out what that happens to the bass there? Yes. When it goes into, uh, tell me who I am. Yeah. Yeah. It just goes. bass right just because I want to keep it light and then we can see what we can put in on the bass because they're all a full bass line it's going to be sure. I think an ordinary bass is going to be too heavy on this don't you yes yeah. that's what it needs is a really light synth bass line yeah and do, do, do. all that stuff you know that would be the cleverest idea wouldn't it wouldn't it do you want to have a go then oh. George is all about R&B. In fact, I think he's probably the best white R&B performer I can think of. In the valley was low, in 